A-I-T-A for not attending my daughter's wedding because she will not allow me to bring my fiancé? Please forgive me if I'm not doing this properly. I do not understand this website. My son is trying to help me and he said that I need to hear unbiased opinions. He said to post here. My wife was in a car accident about five years ago. My children were in the car with her. My son lost his right arm and my daughter was banged up. My wife suffered a traumatic brain injury that left her in a persistent vegetative state. She was basically brain dead and only her brain stem was keeping her alive. After talking to doctors and her family I was ready to let her go. My daughter couldn't accept that. I took her for counseling. We went separately and together with her brother. She could not let go. Thanks to my employer I have excellent insurance. I also earn enough to not really have any monetary concerns. I started attending a grief support group. I met a woman there who had lost her husband. We connected. Maybe a year after we met we started a relationship. We weren't as careful as we should have been, and she got pregnant. We discussed our options and we decided that we had a future together. When she was seven months pregnant she was put on bed rest. I moved her into a room in my house. My daughter did not handle it well. She said I was having an affair. She has never treated my fiancé with basic respect. I know I'm moving on very fast, but my wife and I had a strained relationship for the last few years. She had substance abuse problems and I spent six years trying to hide that from the kids. I still loved her and wanted her to get better. She was high when she crashed her car. I was and am very angry about that. My wife's body got pneumonia and died a year ago. That's when I got engaged. My daughter got engaged when she was 18. I wasn't thrilled but I tried my best to support her. I got my invitation and it didn't include my fiancé or even a plus one. I called her to ask about it and she said that I was a guest and to be grateful I was even invited by myself considering I was having an affair. I said that I wanted to bring my fiancé. She adamantly refused. I RSVP'd that I would not be attending. I still paid for the wedding. I took my fiancé and son to Orlando for that weekend. My daughter has been telling everyone that I chose to go to Disney World instead of her wedding. She is saying that I'm an absolute asshole for putting my replacement family ahead of her. I just want to move forward. My son said to include that I was just a guest at the wedding and not a part of it at all. Like I wasn't going to walk her down the aisle or anything. I think my daughter is being incredibly unfair to my fiancé and her half-brother. None of this is their fault.